Hey everyone, welcome back to Million Dollar Habits. One of the habits that I established in 2017, I always start out the year with a word, is awareness. And that habit alone can really totally change your life. What triggered that for me was in 20, 2005, I went to a workshop in upstate New York. And one of the exercises through five intense days was we were in a room with 200 people and we were separated into five tribes. And our tribe, of course, consisted of about 40 people. And every single morning, we would get in there and there would be 200 plus chairs set up. They would have us break up into our tribes. We would have to physically move our chairs to the side of the room. Now, it sounds kind of weird, but we had to do it in a record time. So he timed us. The gentleman that was doing the instruction timed us. And we had to do it with such speed that it was insane. So what transgressed over the period of the week, well, we kind of developed um, different scenarios of who would be doing what. And I realized that some people didn't have the strength to pick up the chair. They actually were getting in the way. So. For some reason, I became the delegator of who and what was happening during this particular exercise. So I would say, okay, dude, you've got the strength. You carry the chairs to the side. And then there were people that were great at stacking. They could pick up a chair and stack. They were really good at organization. And then there were the people that got in the way. I said, just scoot the chairs in and then move out of the way. So over the course of the week, we did this sometimes two or three times a day. It got aggravating. We're like, why are we doing this exercise? No explanation, nothing. And then you started being aware of what was happening around you. And there was one particular guy that would be screaming. He would be going, get the fuck out of the way. He would be telling people what to do. I mean, vessels in his neck were popping. And we're like, God, stay away from that guy. So at the end of the five days, the last time we did it, the instructor stood up and he said, okay, y'all wanna know why you've been doing this? And we're like, yeah. He goes, because how you do anything is how you do everything. And he let that soak in and we're like, oh my gosh, so how was I during this exercise? I delegated authority in a nice way. I never took anybody out and didn't say, hey, you don't have the strength to do this. I just said, hey, you're really good at moving the chair over and let them pick it up and let them stack it. Hey, you really have the muscle, you have the power, you pick them up and you move them because we wanted to win. I wanted to win this exercise. So it showed me that I want to win, I'm great at delegating, and I do it in a soft, clear way, but in authority. And then the guy that was always cussing, the guy that had the pop veins, he looked at, straight at this guy in the eye and said, and that's how you talk to your family. That's how you talk to your coworkers. That's how you talk to your peers. And we all went, oh my God. We've got to be very, very aware of what we do every single day and develop habits that strengthen us and don't weaken us. So pay attention, use the word awareness, use the thought awareness and develop habits that strengthen and help you get to where you want to go.